I'm here at Divertimenti with Helena Attlee, who is the author of The Land Where Lemons Grow. Welcome to Divertimenti. Thank you. Thank it you, is Julie. a fabulous book, and it charts the history, the culture of citrus in Italy. And I'm curious about where the inspiration came from, because it, it's obviously something you're very passionate about. Well, it really came, um, surprisingly in a way, from ornamental citrus, mm. citrus that I found growing in pots in gardens in Tuscany and Lazio. And I looked at those plants and I noticed that some of them had more than one fruit, you know, different, different kinds of fruit on the same plant. Some of them had fruits that were very, very bizarre. And so I started to look into that. And that's when I discovered that those plants had been part of museums of curiosities. And I thought, this is more than just a fruit. This is a cultural object. And that's where it started many years ago. Because you, you talk about citrus in Sicily, which I would imagine growing, but then also quite far up north, which I was, mm. I was quite surprised. Mm. I had no idea, to be honest, when I started research for this book, that I would be up by Lake Garda, looking at the lemon houses there, Which just seems 46 impossible. degrees north, with the snowy mountains all around it. But it's microclimate. You know, you find citrus in Liguria, which is also very far north. And um, citrus, even if it's not growing in places, it has significance, like Ivrea, again in Piedmont in the north where they have the Battle of Oranges, which is a very which messy, loved. messy occasion. Yes. I mean, and, and, and you talk about the man who came home and, and was covered with bruises and, yeah. you know, war-torn well, from he'd, this. He'd been having oranges thrown at his face all day in this wonderful battle um, that goes on for two days. But, and, and I mean, we know how good citrus is for you, but I was surprised at how good blood oranges are because they seem to be yeah. particularly potent. Yeah, blood oranges are full of um, anthocyanins, which are superfruit ingredient. And they are incredibly delicious and incredibly good for you. I love that. And how much of citrus can we still see in Italy today? I mean, is it remnants? Is it vibrant? How is it? Um, the things that are vibrant are the fruits that are unique mm. to Italy. Um, so things like those blood oranges, uh, the quinotto, which is a little tiny, it's about the size of a golf ball, really, um, which is used as a candied fruit. That's the one in the apothecary jars, is that? Oh, uh, yeah, that's yeah. right. And bergamot, which has this fantastic essential oil. Um, all of those fruits have taken a great dip in the market, but there are people bringing them back, um, nurturing them, trying to get that business going again, which is very exciting. Well, it is a fantastic read. It's The Land Where Lemons Grow by Helena Attlee. Thank you for joining Thank us you. here. Thank you.